Typically runners who experience shin splints have overused the stabilizing muscles of the ankle as well as the dorsiflexion of the foot. The space between the tibia and the fibula has a sheath wrapped around it called the periosteum. This sheath oftentimes is rubbed raw creating inflammation and tension on the shin bone. The muscles lining the anterior portion of the shin is the tibialis anterior, extensor digitorum longus, and extensor halicus longus. Sitting on a chair in a figure four position, locate the edge of the tibia near the thick muscle tissue. To find the tissue we're working on, push the fingers to the edge of the tibia and drop directly into the muscle tissue. Then squeeze into the bone. Move up and down the shin vigorously. After 30 to 40 seconds working in that position, we will work the opposite side of the tibia with the thumbs. Press the fingers into the soft tissue on the opposite side of the shin. Drag the thumbs up and down vigorously for 30 to 40 seconds. Ensure you work all the way from the top to the bottom of the shin. 